Hi everybody, Dr. Tanner here with a message to my students about using generative AI tools like ChatGPT. If you are a doctoral student, it's really a bad idea to use generative AI to write your projects because someday someone will be able to definitively authenticate what was written by ChatGPT and they will call it out, so don't do that. So as I've mentioned in class, there are ethical ways to use ChatGPT and they're all very beneficial to you. I'm including a link from APA that explains how you would cite from ChatGPT. You need to tell the reader what the prompt was, what the output was, and then explain to how, how you used it in your paper. It's really a big deal. So if you have AI write your paper for you, it means that your whole paper is going to be, I told AI to write my paper and AI wrote my paper. <laughs> That's really the only ethical way. And then of course, it's not your work, so I can't grade it. So don't do that. I'm also sharing with you ChatGPT's own ideas for ethical use, and they're pretty good and on point. As you can see by that list, why you shouldn't use AI to write your papers, but why you should use it to brainstorm, come up with ideas, explore theories, generate topic ideas, and ask AI questions like, how can I word this better? Or why doesn't this sound right? Use AI ethically. I know you can do this. Ask questions. Let's start thinking about some intentional uses of ChatGPT, where we don't use it to cheat, but instead we're using it to help our brains work better. Okay, I hope everyone has a great week, and thank you for your time.